In this video, we will see the steps to create a particular smart forms. So the first step is go to the transaction code that is smart forms itself and then provide a particular form name starting with Z and then click on create. Now give a particular description here and just expand the page one folder. So we can see here, this is the page one folder. Just expand it and right click on it and create an address. Now provide the name of the address that is address number we can provide and click on form painter button. So now we can see here a window coming. So we can rearrange the position of address here and place it at the top or somewhere and just, just click on save and activate it. Now if we run our application, we can see our output coming here like this. Now let us see the, all these things practically. So this is the T code that is smart forms. So this is the T code. I will use a form here. The name should be something meaningful. I am just writing smart forms. Create. So that's done. Here we have to provide a meaning. Let us provide it as meaning itself. So that's done. Now we can see this is the form painter here. If we click on form painter, it is now gone. If we click on form painter again, so it is now appearing. So this is the layout here. And here we can see the smart form that we have created. And then there is this global settings. All the form attributes and general attributes are coming here. And then there is pages and windows. Similar to SAP scripts, there were pages and windows. So it is here. So if we just expand it, so here we can see our main window, that is this one. So now we have to create another window. And we have to create address, that is our requirement. And for that we just need to right click here and click on create and click on address. Now we have to provide an address here. So suppose let us provide this is the address that we have to pro we are providing and click on enter so here we go so we can rearrange our address format from here window from here we'll just it should appear somewhere here so that's done we will just save it and activate it so this is just simple as that we have to just save it activate and execute it from here itself so this is the function model that has been created in smart forms and now we have to just do this so here we can see this is the print option coming here so if we cl cl click on print view our address should be coming here so this is the smart form that has been created and this is the address that is coming on the smart form so our requirement is met and hope this steps were clear to you so this was a simple requirement on smart forms so that's it for this particular video thanks for watching